Hello everybody, welcome back to the Binding of Eyes Gathabers. Last run left a bad taste in my mouth, but nothing we can do. Let's go at it again, this time with Lazarus. Which last time was pretty darn amazing, but infamy. Um, nah, it's not bad, but eh. I find pills, and right? a good start for our pill, at least. Look up ain't bad. But we will have to find some stuff before we are able to carry on. See what our item room provides us with. Keep a close eye out for marked rocks as well. A little chad. Well, there's a marked rock. I guess that's okay. Now, if I could use the other dude to blow that up. Okay, come with me. Hey, that way. Up. Oh, no. Too soon. We could kill ourselves, that's one option. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to be doing it though. Can't dig deals with the level anyway, so it wouldn't actually be a bad thing, but... Mm. Loss of health might be bad for us. Let's see if we can blow that dude up over here. If he ever decides to come this general direction. Yeah, I'm over here. Like, ugh. There, now you got it. All right. Yep. There we go. And there's our bombs. All right. Some cash never hurt anyone. And we did get a spirit arch leaf. Until we're done with this floor. Dry baby. Hmm. Well, wouldn't necessarily say it's a bad thing. Oh, hello. <laughs> Didn't expect that. Land. Abel, alright. Not great, but an item is an item. We can double them. I noticed the item that was for sale there. Well, on sale. A throw. That's a free reroll. On any item we would not want to have. You're gonna explode, right? I think you can. Uh, well, you dropped a bomb. Um, shouldn't you be sh shooting in the way I'm shooting? Uh, why are you not? Sh why are you not shooting upwards now? In fact, why are you shooting diagonally now? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, I broke him. Sweet. For some reason, he's not shooting in my direction. Okay. Not expecting that to happen. Now I got two spirit arts. If we die, we die here. Actually, um, wouldn't be the worst because we do get a bit of a damage up. So I guess this is where we decide whether or not we off ourselves. Mm. Sure, let's kill ourselves then. We'll try to leave a red fly alive, which really shouldn't be all that hard. Are you shooting at enemies or something? No, you're not. What are you doing, Abel? Alright, I'll leave one fly alive, which we off ourselves on. Cool. 
We immediately get our health back. A lot of it, actually. <clears throat> okay. Now, how are we going to buy the battery dude in the gym? Yeah, battery buddy, sure. What are we... Jeez, those spike blocks. Stop being weird, spike blocks. Seriously. What are you shooting at, Abel? You're confusing me. Okay, we've got our two bombs. That's nice. So, Abel, where the hell do you go when I'm in this corner? Do you just go off screen or do you hang around somewhere else? Yep, you just go off screen, okay. Well, off screen, I mean, you fly out of the room. Get him, Abel. You got this. Are you actually shooting enemies actively? No. You're just shooting willy nilly in a weird path that's apparently aimed at the center of the room. Well, if that makes you feel good, by all means. Blank card. Works with um, runes as well, if I'm not completely mistaken, which means we got a odd d6. Okay. Could probably make some use out of that. I really just wish there was a reliable way to get into the Mega Satan fight. Ah well. Alright, so this is where we get our deal with the angel. Um, deal with the devil. Which should be a guarantee. If you don't get one here, then there's something wrong with the game. Let's go. Oh, great, it's the haunt. Yay! <laughs> okay. At least you don't have a lot of health, which is nice. Yep, like I said, guaranteed. Judas sh Shadow. Not the greatest item, but. Alright, so anything else we want to do? With just one bomb, I'm gonna guess. There isn't really is no reason to go in there, is there? Did you split into two enemies? Wow. Well, I mean, if a bomb drops in the middle here, we might as well check out what's going on. Oh, uh, let's try our luck. Could be good, could also be just troll bombs. Or spiders. Spiders are an option too. <sighs> Let's check our curse room. I don't know what I expected, to be honest. Something other than this, though. Alright. And now, hell begins. Can we get our angel rooms? Oh boy.
Okay. Let's try to find an item room, room quick. Although we should get a lot of batteries here anyway. Meaning we shouldn't have to take anything we really don't want. Which is nice. Okay, one bomb. Would like another one. Should be dead. There you go. You should follow soonish after. Right, come on. A Joker card would be a great, 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 great find. As would Goathead, but um, yeah, you know, what are the odds, right? Hematemesis. I don't think that counts as red heart damage because we technically didn't get hit. Item rooms are nowhere to be found either. Frickin' bonies, man. Frickin' bonies. Seriously, where are the item rooms at? I say item rooms, but there's only one of them. But still, where the hell is it? Uh, I suppose if you take never used Petro room and instead just go with this we could get a chance of finding that key if we can use it on the chest which means this run is definitely gonna go far or at least as far as the game would let us I mean things can always go to turn sour really quick and we could just die randomly in any given room Of course, hoping it doesn't happen, but you know, it's still a pretty hard game, you know. Death may loom behind every corner, and luckily for us, our item room is nowhere to be found still. We found a shop, guys. Woo! Shop. Apparently the battery can freeze now. Or maybe it always could, I really never noticed. Mystery item, huh? No point in re-rolling that. Ludovico. Hmm. Not sure how I feel about that. Okay, we only have one bomb, which means we can't really go look for other stuff. All right. Green peep. Okay. <laughs> Move that tear up. Well, if I knew that was going to be a right, I would have gotten rid of it. Well, we didn't get a deal with the devil either, which is better than do getting one, because at least now our odds are better of getting another one. Simply getting a deal with the angel would have been better, but, no, well, you know. You know. Alright, let's blow up some of these shopkeeps. And maybe get an item room a bit quicker this time. And actually be able to see what we get. The 
batteries are a nice drop ball every time, but well, thanks for that as well. More bombs means we blow up more shopkeepers. Not that the bonus stacked, but they do have a tendency to have money in them. Alright, compass is good enough to take. Now I sort of want the money just to see what this card is. Alright, so we can bomb our way into our item room. Blue fly, not good enough. Piercing shots, yeah. I like that. Oh, right, we go. Ah, oh, crap, it's pointless. But it looks cool, but pointless. Hmm. The item is so rare, and I know that it's really good, so when I see it, I pick it up, not thinking that, oh wait, we already have that. Lame. Sure, callous. Means we can actually go grab that one bit of money. And see what our card is. Two diamonds. <sighs> of course it would have been. Alright, we can just get this money now. <laughs> Alright. Is there anything left to live for? I don't think there is. Unless we can get to more... Unless we can get more money in. I don't think there is, no. Check for secret room. Check for secret room. Okay, it's the one that only creates enemies, which... I guess is alright. We can uh, just do some of this. I think that's just restart every time when I don't get a key piece in before the depths. It would improve my odds and waste a lot less of my time, but on the other hand, I don't know. What do you know? Alright. Three spirit arts. Not a bad haul, but the main thing here is, of course, our key piece. Thank you, dry baby. What are you doing? What are you, what are you do? What, what are you? What are you doing? What are you? No, no. What are you doing? Just thank you for dying. All right. Do we want to range up? Hell no. Blue into Loma does help us, I believe. I think the tear hits more often, like it ticks more. So okay. All right. Let's carry on. We'll make our way to our item room. Post haste. Yeah, it looks like that's taking a bit more frequent. It moves a bit slower, which is less than ideal, but... Yeah. Bonies! Bonies! 
you explode. So I'm gonna go for those bonies first, if at all possible. Thank you. Thank you. And I see if we can explode one of you guys. Uh, troll bomb, huh? Thanks for that one. Not great. Um, no, I'm just trying to go down, thank you very much. Chair is not quick enough. Paralysis. Ooh. Book of Shadows. Not good enough. Not bad, mind you, not bad, but not good enough either. Hair throw. Money equals power. We do generally end up with a lot of money. And now I actually have a reason to keep our money as well. Mm, I'm gonna stick with the callus. Strange enough, callus does not prevent you from taking damage from going in and out of curse rooms. So many bonies. Just keep them away from me. If I don't move, they don't know I'm here. No, it doesn't work like that, but so far none of them have actually reached me yet. Ugh. Come here, you. Ah. Well, my blank card just ch completely charged up for no apparent reason. Probably from the battery buddy that I have, but... Um, oh, sure, try hitting these chumps. That's gonna be easy, yeah. Let's keep going. I would like some extra bombs and... At this point, some extra money too, but yeah. more bonies. The game really does know what I like, doesn't it? And bombs are just impossible to get. At least you have a few. There's also a red chest, which can be world cards and no bombs. Ball of steel is nice. Steel. Balls of steel. No bombs. No bombs. All right. World card. Uh, let's use. Let's just use it. You're just not gonna give me any bombs, are you? Not a single piece of explosive ordnance. So that's even the right word to use there. Eh. Again, I really couldn't be bugged with things like that. Well, might as well. Could have been something in there. Could have been something in there. Well, there was a reason I really wanted a bomb. Probably because I spotted a marked rock away on somewhere. We're not really getting a lot of consumables in general, are we? Even our money hasn't gone up yet. We just don't get any drops, it seems. I think it's due to... Lazarus starting with bad luck. Let's just use the other thing so I can do stuff like... Woo -woo. Okay. Enough wooing. I just uh... now it's an actual twin stick shooter because I'm using both sticks now. Yeah, we're just not getting any consumables in general. Well, I mean we do, but nothing that'll knock our socks off. Okay, hello.
Well, every bit of money gives us a tiny little bit more damage. Um, do I go for the mock truck or do I go for the secret room? I'm gonna guess secret room is. Uh, oh wait, we only have one bomb, right? We're not going for anything. Let's go in here. Great. No, that's. I wonder if I could do it the other way around. Like I go in there and I get teleported to the curse room. Probably not. Alright, you start me off with an enemy, some of these has got to be good, right? Well, there's some bombs in the spirit, actually. Yep, this was good. And now that we do have bombs, we can go blow up that mocked rock and check our curse room. Where we get one more bomb. Okay, another mocked rock granted. Can blow you up. For good luck. I believe we saw a mock truck somewhere at the top of a room engulfed in fire. But I can't recall which one. So we'll probably have to go through it anyway. Um, they'll blow you up as well. Yeah, I will blow up the donation machine as well. Gotta get some more money in. All right. So where the hell did I spot that marked rock then? Am I really going mad? Well, let's do a boss. This could be a pain in the butt. Good thing we got poop shield, huh? So what do we get? Just don't be a deal with a devil. Anything but a deal with a devil. We get nothing. Okay. Let's do one final check for that marked rock. Could be important. You don't know. Where did I see that thing? Where did I see it? Speak! Was it in the item room? Yeah, it was in the item room. Huh. Boom. Mm -hmm. And our tear just turned red. Good. Alright, let's move on out. Three chances for another angel room. Let's hope for the best. I also didn't reroll small rock because it's a damage up. I like damage. I've got a tier that's this low, we can at least try to make it so that whatever it hits gonna hurt. That speech, right? Whoa. Okay. Yep. More. We might make it so even if our tier isn't the fastest thing around. We're damn well gonna be sure that it hits like a ton of bricks when it does hit something. Pinky eye, huh? Oh, we got Kalas, I can just do this, right? Oh, but I didn't miss out on too many good things by doing that. Right, what do we get? Technology. Does technology work? Wait, doesn't that just become the... Let's take it and see what happens. Uh, we actually still shoot the laser beam, which is actually quite unfortunate. Although... Oh, we can't actually decide where it shoots at? Ah, oh, jeez. Well, let's consider Tech 2 a nice bonus then. Let's see if we can... No, it fires to where our tier is located. Okay. That's gonna be awkward to work with. We got Kalos, we can take this. It doesn't fire. What is going on here? 
Well, we might. We'll try to make the best of it. Um, blue map. It's not worth our money. Because that would mean we were giving up damage. Hmm. Since we have the compass, we know there's nothing. Ah, there's a. Sp ah, we're gonna have to write. Yep, let's head our way over to that spike room. Let's use one bomb here because we can get a good amount of skulls with them. Nothing! So I think the best way we make use of this Tech 2 shot that we have is to just put it on an enemy and then just do circles with our tier so we actually keep shooting uh, Tech 2 as well. It's gonna be weird, but it's what we're gonna do. Ah. I'm constantly trying to aim uh, Tech 2, but it's not doing what I... I really thought we could play chicken with that one. At least tell me that I can play chicken with some of these, considering what I'm planning to do here. Some extra health could be valuable. Okay. okay we've got another black heart at least. Really, three of those? We really needed three? Normally, you only create two enemies, but. Come here! Okay, we're just gonna let... Uh, what? Invisible dude? Or did I just miss something completely? Probably missed something completely. Okay, let's put a bomb here, or we'll get a bomb out of it. Two hours can pretty much shove it. Alright, we came here for the spike room, huh? Oh. Right. Callus apparently protects us from those as well. I did not know. Anyway, we got a drink. One key, so we can't get into that room. All these are red hearts, nothing to do with them. Okay, we got a trinket here. I'm gonna step on the spikes three times. Everything to increase our odds, right? Can't say that I'm not trying. Come on, you feel blessed. Nothing. Nothing. And here it comes. Nothing. Three spirit arts down the drain again. The game hates my blood, alright? Simple as that. Let's go get Callus. Put a bomb here just because, why not? Judgment, huh? Which one is it? It's a normal one. I'm gonna oh, look at thing. I think there's something about blowing those up or letting them pay out, but I need to know for sure. Devil room. Destroying one normal beggar on the current floor gives you a plus 35% chance to get a devil room. Now, angel room.
Donating to a normal beggar until it pays out with an item on the current floor gives me a 10% extra chance to get uh, one of those. So at this point, it basically becomes a thing. Do I want a 10% another roll for 10% chance for deal with a devil? Or do I just want to blow it up for 35? For ah. Sixth sacrifice of a sacrifice room. What? Teleport to Devil Angel. Why am I only learning about this now? It's only a 33% chance, that's why. We did five already. Did we just go for a sixth and see what? No, we did three. If we were on any other floor, it would have been easy, but we can't leave. The mom fights. And we can't actually blow you up because we don't have any extra bombs, so we're just gonna let you pay out with an item then. Knowing full well that we're giving up damage to do this. Well, now you're giving us an interesting proposal. Um, what are our odds for an angel room? Uh, for an angel room as they stand. We have a base chance of 50 for having uh, just a base chance. Rolling, keep his one, giving us another 25% roll. Devil beggars. Do we have devil beggars? I don't think we do. I don't think we do. No. Okay, so we have 50% and another 25. So 50% plus a 25% basically means a 5 out of 8, which translates to 76.5% chance. Getting another 10% in would really not make the number much higher. Let's see, devil room chances. Let's see what we are on that end. Uh, we did not get one on the previous floor. So, we blew up a dead shopkeeper. And we took no red heart damage on the entire floor. Basically, we have a 110% device, 55, 110, 105% uh, chance if you do not blow up the dude. If you do blow up the dude, that's 100 and 45 divided by 2, 70, 70, 70, 72 and a half. I think we blow them up. Sorry, dude. What's this? Rusted key. Alright, so let's go get Kala's back as well, which is up above us, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, the numbers game. It's 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 a thing. It's definitely a thing. I'm not a big fan of the of it though, but we gotta we gotta do it. All right, let's go. Where's our tear at anyway? Seriously, where? Oh, there it is. Now, of course, this means we cannot take red our damage. So focus, god damn it, focus. Damn it, don't tell me we're gonna take red heart damage. This sucks. So hard. Oh, 
Well, if I screw up by taking red art damage, then clearly there's no one to blame but myself. Yes. And there it is. But we still get an angel room. What? Is this the game atoning? For all the evil it did to me? I like it. What? We're gonna have to go over the numbers again after this one. Actually, we can probably do it right now. 44. No, 40, uh, 35 for blowing up the dude. And a base chance of 1%. So that's 36 divided by 2. It's 18%. And then a 67% chance that that turned into a... Angel room. So... Grand total. We got lucky there. And I will spend a key on this. Now, did we have red hearts or not? Doesn't matter, we can't leave this room. Okay, well... We got the thing. You hold on to that battery, buddy. Now we can actually start looking after a different tarot card if we so desire. I think Ludovico was the thing that screwed me over long with the darkness and stuff like that. I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't have gone into that corner as much as I did. Okay, so what card would I want now? Well, card or rune? Well, I don't know. There's a lot of good stuff that can be picked. Sun card would be cool. For obvious reasons. Even our chair gets sucked in there, I don't know what to do. Like, ah, save me, master. And like, nope. Okay, what do we get? Judgments. They cost us money. But we can blow them up. Boom. We can actually use a normal judgment. Yeah, they cost us money, which is uh, currently our damage potential. <sighs> Although having one payout would probably go a long way in trying to snack some more useful items. Let's give it a go. Please pay out, though. Bean. Nope. Throw. Yeah. More health is always welcome. It only cost us half our money, so... Just genuinely have money in them. Cool. And they say money doesn't bring happiness. Mm. cards over there. Mm. Yep. That had to happen, obviously. Okay. Let's start saving up some keys so we can actually get our chest items as well if we do it. I don't know how close I am to death. And I can't die again either. What I do, know, however, is that we are definitely on sp not on spirit hearts. Health up. 
thank you kindly. All right. Um. <laughs> yeah, thanks for the battery, but I think I got plenty though. I just keep getting hit way too much. Guess a sun card is too much to ask for. Plenty of batteries. Are you repelling my bullet? Oh my god, you are! Well, you can't shove away the laser, so... Where's the tear at? There it is. Go get him. Um, uh, sure, let's do the boss. Skull X. Should be doable, I think. Yeah, we're hitting him. Not a ton, but... We're definitely hitting him. He's hitting us as well, which means these devil are now really not gonna happen. But we got what we needed from those rooms. So I don't know if you get another item from you. I think we do. Which is great, we got Plenty of opportunities to re-roll it. Because we definitely don't want a... That thing. Uh, that's a damage up. Yeah, I'll take that. Alright, we've got five bombs. Let's see if we can find a secret room with that thing. Plenty of opportunities. That's kind of unfortunate. So it could be not there. Okay, good. Means we don't have to check. Which I appreciate. With a bit of luck, it's actually below us. Well, not now. It can't be below us now, but in a bit it can. If it's down here, that would be cool, actually. We could blow ourselves into our uh, curse room as well. Nope. Okay, let's see if it can be here on the right. So we'll go here. We'll check all the rooms because I really want to be careful with my bomb usages. It looks like it could be here. There we go. Money, money, money. Greed fight. Yeah, that'll give us money. Please don't give us steam sale. Thank you. Alright. Every 25 cent is one whole point of damage. It's not to be negated. <coughs> Alright. Let's keep going. Let's try these for a second secret room, perhaps? No, and. Yes. Cool. Alright, with a bit of luck, we'll be able to see our health again. Yep. Oof, we got a lot of empty uh, containers there. Didn't think it was this bad. Okay, the annoying one's gone. And I just ran into one. Yeah! Living life! To the fullest! Alright, we got our arcade open. This is not going to be easy. We are not overpowered, alright? Health is... 
Six heart containers ain't bad, but you know, we need to fill them first. Money's alright. I got stuck again. Ugh. This would not have happened had I had flights, which I didn't have. Never did get the ability to get it to begin with. Don't be bad trip. I want to make sure larger. All right, cool, cool beans, cool beans. Why do they slide over to me like that? Telepills. I'd rather not use telepills. Bad things can happen with telepills. Oh, this has swipe. Shouldn't be too bad if I stay away from him. He drops the left hand. Do we want the left hand? I don't think we do. We want normal chests to get more cash out of him. They're really not getting much health in either. Dreadful shame. Considering when uh, we are really close to death. Why is no one giving us health? Okay. Relax. Change is coming. Right? Nope. Not exactly. Oh, great, another one of these pills. Wait. Oh, boy. No, I really don't think the game would be this much of a jerk now. I can spend money. I might just spend my last bomb blowing up this thing. And it gives me a minimal payout. One cent. How many times does a blood bank when you blow up give you one cent? Usually it's like three cents, two hearts. No, one cent. One freaking cent. Thanks, game. Yeah. I, uh, I really do appreciate all of this. Let me guess. Bombs and keys. Ah, just bombs. Great, now I get to go spend a lot of money to get some health back. I might get killed in the arcade over it. That's gonna be brilliant, isn't it? Great keys, yeah, that's what I wanted. Good lord. Told you. Wow. Fuck this game, and I'm not even gonna bother doing a normal intro. Bye, everyone.